Yeah. yeah. I know the run the run wasn't in gold and silver. I know that for a fact. No, it was not, which is annoying. But um yeah, that's like I think that is the only new thing. But you know, same premise, new region. Um three the three stars in this game were Chikorita. No. Not Chikorita. Torchic. Trico. Trico, Torchic, Torchic and Mud Kip. I heard you like Mud Tips. <laughs> <laughs> I knew we were gonna drop that out at some point. And um, God damn. um, your rival's not an asshole in this game. Your rival actually helps you. She's like your best friend. Except there's like, there's, there's, it's this this game was actually very weird about that. Like, you had Wally, you had uh, Don, Don, and then you had Steven. Like, these three help you out and stuff, but of those three, Steven's the one that becomes champion. You know, until you beat him and make him want to drown his sorrows because he lost to a kid. <laughs> um, and like um, every game, there are the legendaries. The trio in this game were the Reggies. Which are pretty cool. I mean, it... There's Reggie Ice, Reggie Rock, and Reggie Steven. Actually, no. Before we get that, there are actually two trios and then one duo. Yeah. Yeah. There was a... There was a... There was a... Reggie Rock, Reggie Ice, Reggie Steel, which and, are... And then Kyogre, Groudon, and Rayquaza. Now, Groudon and Kyogre were the version mascots. Right. But Rayquaza eventually got his own game. Yeah, he... I forgot to talk about Pokemon Crystal. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, whatever. They don't care about that. <laughs> Crystal's just gonna remake a gold silver with Suicune as the mascot. I'm telling you to know. So anyway. So um the interesting thing about this one, like they did add like three more uh legendaries. Uh yeah. Ronald and Kyogre Rayquaza. And they were the weather Pokemon. Right, you could you could say they Groudon were the weather being, trio. Groudon being Earth, Kyogre being water, and Rayquaza being the sky. Well, Ray, what Rayquaza did, he wasn't really a weather so much as he killed weather. Like there's, there one thing, like, one of the things that Ruby Sapphire did was introduce uh, weather conditions in battle. So uh, Rayquaza, when he was in battle. Airlock. Weather effects would not work. Which now, in terms of brings plot, me, brings Kyogre me... and Groudon are rivals, and they fucking hate each other. Well, before we get into that, brings me to another point about Airlock. We get abilities in this game. Pokemon can do these different things given an ability. So now... Is this the game where the abilities were introduced? Yes, they were. Okay. So yeah, we get that now, which is actually pretty cool. So all the legendaries have almost the legendaries are the same one though. A lot of them is just pressure. Yeah, but then then you have Kyogre and Groudon, and they get awesome little abilities like that. Yeah. Groudon, when you brought him into play, made sunny it so day. that you had Sunny Day, so you could be like a uh, Solar Beam without charging. And then and Kyogre's fucked. <laughs> Kyogre was kind of like, yeah, I'm gonna make it rain, so Thunder always hits. Yeah, too bad that wouldn't do too much on Groudon because he's a rock. He's a ground type. Yeah, too bad that Groudon's kind of weak to Kyogre. Suck it. Yeah, I know. They're rivals, right? I don't get this. They're rivals. But Groudon has a significant type disadvantage to Kyogre. It's pretty unfair, but Rayquaza has a significant type disadvantage to Kyogre. I think Rayquaza is actually a shit ton more powerful than Kyogre, though. Yeah, you know what Rayquaza's quad weak to? Ice. Plus, ice. <laughs> and you know what Kyogre can learn? Ice, ice beam. beam. And Blizzard, I think. Yeah. Yeah, every water can learn ice type moves. Yeah, I don't know why that is, but whatever. Well, I mean, you can. it kind of makes sense because you're just cooling down water and then using I mean, the in terms of stats, obviously, Rayquaza is the strongest of the three. Um. Um. 
No. You're a Kyogre fanboy. Shut up. Well, actually, I can back this up. Okay. You want you want me to? What are the total base stats for the both of them? I know um, Kyogre's special def- or special attack is 150. Mewtwo's is still higher. By three points. <laughs> Mewtwo is still higher. Mewtwo would win. Well, yeah, but I'm not saying he wouldn't. Actually, I don't know, because Kyogre has 140 base stat special defense. Which You're putting is pretty... a psychic against a water type. <laughs> okay, your point is? Who's faster, first off? Um, you two, but 140 special defense. Now He's a fucking Kyogre's a fucking whale! What are now, you now, hold on. Mewtwo should still have the upper hand because um, I'll, I'll explain that later when we get into black and white because right now he would just be like, well, why is he going off topic like that and explaining stuff that's in black and white when you guys aren't going to uh, Ruby Sapphire? Derp. Then um, the duo, because um, Gold and Silver are just Pokemon like to run around like assholes. Of course, they also introduced... um. Two other legendaries that you can't... Latios and Latias. Well, I was going to mention Jirachi and Deoxys, but yes, Latios and Latias are like the legendary dogs in that they run a um, lot. Ruby, you got Latios. Sapphire, you got Latias. Oh. One's a male, one's a female. Yeah. They're the but same you... fucking thing either way. But they can't breed. Uh, Latios is like better attacking. But Latios has better defense. Latios is cooler, just saying. Yeah. But, by the way, Rayquaza's special defense kind of takes him out of the game. How bad is his special defense? 90. And I expected him to be really powerful. I'm upset now. I mean, he's got 150 <laughs> attack and a 150 special attack. But uh, he takes an ice beam to the face. It's kind of like him taking... It's kind of like... Uh, Taking an arrow to the knee. He used to be good. Um, all the games have the special event Pokemon that you can only obtain through certain conditions. Which we should have mentioned blue, before. Red and blue was Mewtwo. Gold Silver Mew. was Celebi. Who, Mew. Celebi was Gold Silver. Who gives a fuck about Mew and Celebi? And then... Ho, uh, or Jirachi, for that matter. And then Ruby and Sapphire introduced two special event Pokemon. So actually, he wasn't in Ruby Sapphire initially. Who? Deoxys. He was originally introduced Fire Red Leaf Green. No, yeah, yeah, that's right. That's. Yes. But generation wise, he's he he's a Generation Three Pokemon, but he was introduced in Ruby Fire Red Leaf Green. Yeah, there, there's some some plot driven thing to it that explains it, but I don't remember it. I don't know dick about Deoxys. I know he's fucking beast, though. Oh, my God. Isn't he, like, the strongest Gen 3 Pokemon? He's... It depends on the form that he's in, but... Deoxys has four forms. Base, attack, defense, and speed. Speed is fucking useless. Speed is very worthless. Defense will never die. Yeah, defense has 160 base stat special defense and defense. That's the highest defense stat ever. He's not going to die. Well, actually, I, hold on. I can't say ever because I think Shuckle might have more. I don't know who that is. And you don't know Shuckle? Who's Shuckle? He's from Generation 2, you asshole. <laughs> oh, is he that little fucking like worm thing in the red shell? Yes. <laughs> I hate him. Oh, I lied. <laughs> Shuckle takes the cake for defense. You ready for this? You ready for this? This is... He has the most ridiculous stats I've ever seen. Like, funny stats, okay? So what were Shuckle's stats before our internet fucked up? <laughs> Alright, so as I was saying, so... His defense and special defense are 230 base stat. What? <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> but you know what he's... <laughs> Here's here's the breakdown of everything else, right? Okay, so his HP is 20 base stat. 
Talk about what? hilarious. <laughs> His attack is 10. His special attack is 10. You know what his speed is? What, like two? You were close. It's five. <laughs> <laughs> the worst Pokemon ever. It's more like the trolliest. <laughs> his defense is ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> so as I was saying, so, um, so defense form has like the second best defense stats but he can actually attack and move and then um his attack form is really high attack but everything else is worthless 180 attack and special attack and 150 speed that's higher than Mewtwo yeah but he has 20 defense and special defense yeah. he's gonna get owned he's basically you get one attack off or you don't <laughs> What you need is his base form. That's the most balanced. Yeah, base form is 150 in both attack and special attack, and 150 in speed. Yeah, it's definitely the most balanced. But his defenses are 50 and 50. So, uh... Mewtwo still has the edge. Mewtwo will always have the edge! <laughs> <laughs> and, Mewtwo! And then here's, here's the hilariously bad speed form. 50 HP, 95 attack, 90 defense, 95 special attack, 90, 90 special defense. You ready for his speed? 200 something? 180. I'm disappointed now. I'm pretty disappointed with this thing too. It's like, yeah, you could be the fastest thing that ever lived. You're just not going to do anything else. Uh, the Ruby and Sapphire are really good games. Yeah, the criminal organizations for them are Team Aqua and Team Magma. It, it depends on what version you have. Sapphire, you got Team Aqua, and Team Magma were your allies. Reverse that in Ruby. Yeah. But overall, like, one team's concerned with creating more land with Groudon, Team Magma. Team Aqua is more concerned with making more seas. Or, like, expanding the bodies of ocean. With Kyogre. Yeah. I hate them both. Moving on. Yeah, both are pretty stupid in the end. Now we get on to a couple more of the spin-offs. 